see if the buildings help. Alrighty guys, welcome, welcome. This is your host ID Jester. We're in John Tiller's software playing Advance of the Reich. And this is a squad leader type game and individual units and weapons and everything. And we're going to be playing a scenario from the Advance of the Reich. There are several different modules in this squad level series of games. And this is uh, East Front Action. This one is going to be called... Heavy tanks at Ros Rosnesi. Ros Rosnesi. I'm not sure how to pronounce that. Probably butchered it, but that's okay. 24th of June, 1941. The appearance of heavy Russian tanks during the initial invasion of Russia caused some panic when they were first encountered by the advancing German forces. The German Panzer divisions, which had previously been unstoppable across Europe, found that none of their available guns, sort of the rare 88mm, was capable of penetrating these monsters. Only with great courage and tenacity were they able to halt the advancing Russian tank force and resume their advance. Alrighty, so let's... Uh, I want to put everything on manual. We're going to be playing as the Axis, um, but I think the Russians get the first turn, and if I just put them on automatic... We won't get to actually see the scenario set up or anything. So I'm just going to leave them on manual. Once we get in the game, then I'll switch the Russians over to automatic. Uh, and for rules, uh, I think we'll just leave everything off, I guess. Uh, yeah, sure. Yeah, so the allies get to go first, turn one of nine. So there's nine turns in this scenario. Support exists in this scenario. And... You can see the Russians are coming down this way. They have a KV-1 and another KV-1 and another KV-1, another KV-1. T-26, I think that is. T-26, T-26, and then a bunch of trucks carrying some different squads. On the other side, we have the Germans here. Ooh, we got one sitting up here just waiting for them to come out in the open where we get a shot at them. This is a Flame Panzer II. We also have a Panzer III. Several of them. Quite a few of them. And then we have some trucks carrying some squads. And some more squads, some more squads. Here's a uh, 50 millimeter um, mortar. Here's a, eight, a 37 millimeter AT gun. Another one, we got an IG-18 75mm infantry gun, and some more squads and stuff. So, alright, so that's the setup. Uh, looks like there's two objective hexes worth 30 points each. There's a, a little hill we're coming across. You can see the hill kind of along the edge there. Uh, if you go into view, and you'll be, we'll be spending a lot of our time into shade, uh, shade visible hexes. If we click on that, you can see uh, if we position some of our units up here in the hill, we'll get some good line of sight. Obviously, we won't get some out here in the open. Some good um, angle of attack there, and you can see how the line of sight just goes into the first hex of the. Uh, the tree lines there, which is super cool. So right now I'll just turn that off. But uh, yeah, so we got this. We got this hedge or uh, hill side here. We might be able to take advantage of that a little bit. But let's see how well our tanks do as the Russians are coming in over this bridge. Hopefully we can ambush them a little bit and do some damage. Let's see. So we're gonna switch the AI over to automatic. Uh, you know what, we don't want to process fast because there's not enough units to really process it fast. And it'll only take a minute to go through their turn. He comes right up. Oh! Got a hit on it, but didn't do anything. Got another defensive fire. 
Got some more tanks coming in. This guy shoots again. Oh, we blew one up. Blew another one up. Yeah. Oh, he's blown up quite a few vehicles. And then they bring up their infantry and start shooting at us. Alright, so we ended up uh, wiping out a few T... We got a KV-1 and a couple of T-26s. So it shows you uh, <coughs> the side armor and rear armor of these vehicles as they were coming by aren't as strong. So we're going to uh, we're going to try and flank these guys, and I uh, wonder if it gives us the information. Armor seventy. These are all KV ones. Now if we look at our, we have armor fifteen. <laughs> so you can see what a big difference. An armor thirty there. So yeah, we definitely need to flank these guys, and of course. We do have to worry about their infantry as well. All right, so what do we got here? So if we click on this guy, so you can see, he can see everyone. So if we start just moving our trucks down the line, these guys will all be able to just tear them up. This guy won't, but the rest of these guys will. So we have to be a little more careful here, unfortunately. So these are infantry. What I'm going to try to do is get a couple infantry, unload them behind the uh, tree lines, and then start moving them up. Let's see if we can do that. So we're going to select our unit. Move them over there, and then we're going to command uh, unload. There's our guys, and then... Um, they're on a movement point, so let's go ahead and uh, toggle, put them on the ground. So if they got this white bar on the bottom, that means they're laying on the ground, which is a good thing. All right, here's another squad. Let's see if we can... Oh, we're going to get shot. No. All right. Let's drive that guy up. And we're going to unload our guys. And do we want to move up one more? Mm, these guys will be no use against these vehicles. So no sense. No sense in doing it. All right. Another squad here. All right. Let's unload our guys. And... Oh, that, 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 that's it for them. All right, we're going to... No sense in putting these guys on the ground because they're behind the trees, so they won't be able to get shot at. So... Uh, there might be mortars, though, you know? All right, uh, we're going to toggle these guys. Oops, I have to select them. There you go. All right, so we are going to actually... Put them on the ground. Put them on the ground, boys. Put them on the ground. In case mortars come in. All right. So, what else do we have here? So, we got a mortar. So, let's find a good position for this mortar. So, the best way to find positions in John Taylor game is go into view, shade, and go into vis visible hex. So, you can see if we set up right there, we will only be able to target units down the road here. What we want to do is target anyone down there by that bridge. So if we click, say, over here, can we see anything? Yeah, we see a little bit more over there. So it might be worth moving our mortar truck. It's going to take us a few turns to probably get it through the forest, but I think it's worth the effort. All right, boys. Can we unload? Can we still unload? We can unload. Now, can you guys make it to there? No, you're out of movement. Ah, oh, damn. All right. 
That's okay. And I should try to remember what that, I uh, think it's, is it H or is it V? Oh, it's not V. Hmm. All right, so now we have, what do we have here? 37 millimeter AT gun. Again, not the greatest weapon in the world. Visible hexes. I think setting them up right there would be okay. So, um, let's grab our truck. And unload. Just getting shot at. Fortunately, nobody got injured. Fortunately. Oh. All right, I need to get this truck out of there. I'll just pull them back, that's fine. Now, as far as this weapon goes, which way are you pointing? Which way are you pointing? I guess it doesn't matter because he, he should be okay there, I think. In fact, we might even be able to, we, it looks like we still have green movement points, so we could still attack if we wanted to. Uh, we'll wait on that though, we'll wait on that. All right, let's see. What else do we got? Another AT gun. So I'm thinking bringing this guy over here. If we put him right there, he'll be able to target anyone in between these two. So that's going to be our goal. All right. So. And. Unload, unload, unload. There you go. All right, truck. Can you get any more movement points? No. Okay. So truck's going to be there. All right, what else do we got? We got a AG-18 75mm AT gun. Okay. Uh, let's try and set that up. We're going to have mortar over there. Yeah, let's try and set up over here. Okay. Right. Unload. Uh, unload. They out of movement points. They are yellow. Maybe to, maybe it takes more movement points to unload in the forest, which is a possibility. Hey, Gray, how you doing? Seeing this just gives me the itch for steel tigers. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't look like you're gonna be able to unload those guys, unfortunately. All right, what else do we got? Uh, another one, huh? Um. All right, you come over here. Unload right there if you can. Nope, they're out of movement too. Okay, damn. Uh, a couple squads. This guy has a um, flamethrower and a couple satchel charges. So another squad. And if we can get them down towards the front line without getting them killed, it would be a good thing. And can you guys get in there? You can. What about there? Nope. All right. And you guys go to ground. There you go. All right, one more. Same thing. All right. We've masked 
in this one area, which is kind of bad. But fortunately, in John Tiller games, artillery is notoriously bad at aiming, so... All right, now we need to decide. I'm gonna try and flank a couple tanks out over here so we can hit these guys from the side. They might get shot on the way. That's gonna be it for him. All right, what about you? I want to turn counterclockwise. Oops, I gotta select the tank, don't I? Haha. <laughs> Counterclockwise, there we go. Uh, can we turn clockwise? Nope, out of movement points. Damn. Yeah, I don't think just shooting these. Do I have a penetration of 40, but yeah, I just don't think. Fortunately, I turned just in the nick of time. I wanted to spread out our tanks a little bit. So, let's take a shot. That's it for him, all right. Since these tanks are so close, maybe we can get... Oh, no, nope. we got blown up is what happened there. All bad, all bad, bad, bad stuff. Now let's see if we can shoot these guys. In. Ugh. Well, that didn't last long, did it? Boy, oh boy, oh boy. Alrighty, well. That's it for turn one. Let's go to the next turn. Here comes their mortars. Miss, miss. And another miss, that's good. Hey Steeler fan, how you doing buddy? Oh, oh, that one landed. Nobody, they didn't get anybody, good. That one missed. And another miss. I saw your message, you just ordered the hunters. Yeah, pretty exciting. Taking some opportunity fire here. Uh, what I should do is turn down the volume in this. Should be pretty low. Ooh, AT gun opportunity fired there, that's good. Lots of opportunity fire here. We just haven't got a good shot. We did kill one of them, it looks like. I think I, we must have killed it when I was... No, that's our our unit. What did... Uh, oh, he's got two vehicles there. Interesting. Interesting. All right, what do we have here? We have our mortar team, right? We're going to put them right there. All right, it's time to start bringing some mortar fire down on their head. We pinned them. All right, I'll take that. Let's see if we can work our way around. Rotate, rotate, rotate! There we go. Try and get a side shot on one of these suckers. Except for out of movement points. All right, let's move the truck out of there just so we don't have to worry about the truck anymore. 
because I think trucks are worth victory points, actually. Uh, all right, you guys should unload, though. There you go. Now let's get the truck. Move the truck out of there. All right, you unload. All right, it takes all the removing points to unload from the truck. All right, let's just get, get these trucks out of here. You guys, AT gun. All right, well, let's take a shot. Just not enough firepower to do anything against that tank. Mm. All right, we're gonna uh, bring another vehicle up. And then take a shot. Damn. Can't do anything about them, can I? Just, just bouncing off their stupid armor. 70 armor. All right, uh, have you guys shot? You guys have not shot. All right, take a shot. Take another shot. Take another shot. All right. So what we want to do is move up our guys with the little satchels. Where are those guys? Right here. We're going to move these guys up. And then we're going to... Drop him on the ground. Here's another guy with satchels. We're gonna move him up. Uh, let's see how far he can move. So we can actually shade reachable hexes. So that's it. Okay, well, there's no sense. I was gonna try and maybe move him up here, but probably not a great idea. All right, we're gonna move that guy there. That's fine. These guys here on the ground, we're just going to slide them over a hex. These guys here, we don't need the truck. The truck! The truck, you can get out of here. Three trucks in this X? All right, well, move them. Get them now out of there. All right, get the trucks out of the way at least. Let's see what this thing can do. Can it do any damage? Let's see. Not a lot. That guy's already shot. These guys have all moved. This guy hasn't moved, but nowhere really for him to go. That guy's shot. That guy's shot. He's done. He's done. He's done. He's done. And they're done. All right. So there's turn number two. Whoops. There are different views. So you have like a zoomed out view. You have a, a middle view. And then you have a closer view. And then you have 3D which is not the best looking in the world. But, yeah. All right, turn, done, boom. It's only a nine turn scenario, so. Uh oh, here comes the artillery. See, that's why I was, didn't want to bunch everyone up in one little. Oh, fortunately they didn't hit anybody. Oh. And their mortars are much more inaccurate than ours because they 
They're doing indirect fire as opposed to direct fire. Took a pot shot at it. More guys moving up. Oh, they're really hammered us here at the front lines. Wow. Damn. Oh, another, we got a guy that got down, the guy's down. Okay, looks like they brought up some more reinforcements. So uh, let's see how things are going. How, how's the war progressing, boys? Right now it's a Russian major defeat. They need to get... So far, the Germans have lost four vehicles, no men. They lost 38 points. The Axis... I've lost two men in two vehicles for 23 points. They need to get at least 90 points to get a minor victory. So they're going to have to... That's 30, that's 60. I think they're going to have to outkill us and capture both objectives just to get a minor victory. So, so far, I like our odds. Panzer three, fire, fire, fire. Damn. Fire. Damn. Ooh, our uh, Pack 35 are disrupted from all the fire they've been getting. Peace. All right, we're going to crawl these guys up here. They're going to get all kinds of attacks, but we're going to crawl them up there anyways. Just hold steady, boys. All right, that wasn't too bad. So now we got our Sansal charges and our flamethrowers right at Jason. So if he doesn't move on that point, we're going to go after him. Uh, you guys shot? You guys haven't shot. Uh, let's try him. That was kind of stupid. Let's try him. That's it, huh? All right, mortar time. Let's bring some mortars down on this guy's head. I can't see him because of what? Uh, because you're on the ground? Is that what's going on? Oh, and now you're disrupted. Hmm. Well, that didn't work out so well, did it? Ooh, we got a guy. We got a guy. Nothing there. Okay. These guys are pinned. Oh, this tank's immobilized. These guys are disrupted. These guys are pinned. These guys are disrupted. And... Can you guys shoot at them? 
Oh yeah, all right, we got a guy, that's good. Shoot him again. Oh, we got another guy. And then one of our units become disrupted. All right. I'm actually gonna move these guys back there. There we go, and take a shot. Oh, you guys should be on the ground, by the way. Get on the ground. Get on the ground. Oh, you're on the ground. Good. Uh, you guys can shoot these. Hit them. Oh, that squad's taking a beating now. Let's see how many guys are down to. Down to nine men. Looks like they lost... Three so far? Lost three guys? Tanks just can't do anything to these KV-1s. I don't know what we're going to do. I guess that's what that scenario is about, right? These monster mammoth tanks showing up. Stopping the German advance. All right. Uh, I think we're good. Let's go to the next turn. Hey, Philip. How you doing, buddy? Oh, they got two of our guys. That's not good. More of their... Oh, don't get us. No, good. Panzer. That's indirect fire. It's not very accurate. Oh, we, pin, we pinned some guys. Oh, got a guy there. Oh, another guy. Oh, we got another guy there. That's good. Oh. oh! All right, turn four, nine, almost halfway done here now. How are you guys doing here? You guys are doing good. I think we might try to assault this. Let's see. Let's see, how do we... Uh... Oh, let's check out our victory while we're looking at it. So, so far, the Russians have 10 points total. 30 points in objectives. And they lost... 7 men and 4 vehicles. So far, we lost 4 men and 2 vehicles. Alright. Oops. Now, how do we assault? I think we just right-click it, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, we lost three men. They lost nothing. Really? Wow, that was... kind of unfortunate. Not exactly what I wanted to see. Hit that guy! Oh, there went a tank. Ugh. I'm trying to hit him from the side. I want to turn clockwise and again. There we go. Okay. 
That's it, huh? Ugh. Another one blown up. Wow. We got nothing to stop him. We got nothing. Nothing. somebody back there. Oh, there we go. Got another guy. All right, we're going to move these guys up there. These guys are going to... I think they're going to stay right there. All right, what about you guys? Let's see. Nothing. Hmm. Let's try this guy. There's a lot of guys in that hex, so I was hoping to get some kills. Oh, there's one. Alright, we'll take one. Oh, another one. Good shot. Now our disrupted mortar. Oh, exceeded his maximum, really. Okay. Um how about these guys? How about these guys? Oh, there we go. Whole lot of nothing there. Okay. Well, I think that's it for turn number four. Let's see what we can do here in turn number five. Uh oh, more artillery. Duck, boys, duck. Keep your heads down. Oh no, rain on her. Twice. Oh, two of them rain on our heads. Fortunately, he didn't kill anybody. Uh oh, coming in on us. Nope, didn't do anything. Didn't do anything. Good. Hurry up. Hurry up. Hurry up. Oh, got a guy there. Good. I was going to zoom out so we can see where the fire is coming from. Boy, that middle section is just attack, fire, opportunity fire, back and forth and back and forth. Oh no, they got one of our mortar guys. That's not good. Alright, on to turn number five. Still can't do anything about these stupid tanks sitting here just hanging out. Well, I guess we'll just keep shooting at them. Oh my god. Alright, what I'm going to do is I'm going to throw this satchel charge in there and see if that does anything. Do I need to click it? There we go. Let's try that. Oh, good lord! I did it to myself? <laughs> that was dumb. Ah, uh, that was really dumb. I meant to click that space. There you go. Well, there went our sandal charges. Okay. 
Can you do anything with the flame thing? Oh, we got it! Excellent! Excellent! Take that! Now you guys, oh you're pinned. I was gonna say, run out and grab that point! <laughs> You boys, go get that point. Uh, let's see. Let's target these guys back here. Oh, we got another one of these guys. Oh, and another one. Oh, I was hoping to make it three for three. How's our uh, AT gun? Still disrupted, huh? Hmm. All right, let's, let's aim up here. Oh, you're done. You're done. Um, I think we're going to move these. Uh, you're on the ground. We need to move you. Not on the ground. Oh, we'll have to get you next time. Damn. All right, so... Oh boy, our uh, we have one man in our mortar crew. The other guy is uh, the other couple guys are gone, so it's under crewed. <laughs> boy, uh, let's see if can he still attack with it? Yeah, he can. He's gonna drop the little bombs in himself and target himself, and he missed. These guys are disrupted. Um, let's just let these guys sit there. Uh, let's see if we can... Nothing. All right, all right, all right. Well, we got one of their tanks. That should be helpful. Yes, they lost five vehicles. We lost four. They lost 16 men, we lost 8, so they're losing twice as many guys. That's good. Alright, we're done with turn 5. Only a couple turns left. Oh no! Nothing. Whew. Go massive attack in the middle again. Hopefully that's not too loud for you guys. I do have the var I have the volume turned at eight percent. Because I know how loud John Taylor games can be. Eight, eight percent. Uh oh, lost a guy there in the middle. Right now it's their tanks versus their two tanks versus our two tanks. These guys have like earned the Iron Cross, man. These Panzer 3Es have stuck up to those um, KV-1s. So good for them. Yo, can you guys move out of there? That would be awesome. Oh, you can. Okay, good. Let's move these guys up now. Huh. Oops, not you guys. Huh. Let's 
going to move these. Uh, they won't move any farther. That's fine. I was going to move up this group because now we got some more satchel charges. And so if any of these tanks come up there next to us. All right. Uh, let's see here. Well, we'll take a couple pot shots with our. Oh, got one a guy. That's good. Oh, another one. Take another one out. Nope. All right. What about you guys? Oh, there's a guy. Oh, two guys. Nice. And our AT gun. I'll take a couple shots. Took out a couple more there, guys. I'm happy about that. Mortar. Nothing. Oh, we're down to one tank left. I think I'm gonna, can I move you guys back? I cannot move you guys back, okay. It's gotta be a toad weapon, all right. Well, take a shot then. Um, no, okay. Yep, all right, I think that's it. Next turn, boom. Hope they finally move their mortar up. Oh, maybe not. Still using indirect fire. Well, they got two hits on us. Oh, there's a guy. I'll see back and forth action there in the middle again. Can't do anything about these these tanks. It's so hard to do anything about them. All these attacks and they're just but if they want that other point they're gonna have to move up. So Can't move up while we keep shooting them. So, turn seven. Yeah, just a couple more turns. Well, I guess we'll attack with this tank again. Well, he's done nothing the whole match. We could try to jump out and grab that point, but I think we'll wait. I'm actually not going to shoot any of my guys this turn and see if we can rest them a turn. See if they'll recover from disruption. These guys in the front lines there, right by the Russian point. These guys have been attacked like 50 times. They're, they're holding tough though, so. 
give them full credit. They're still there, getting attacked. Still disrupted. Still under crude. Um, let's get nothing. Hmm. They're still disrupted as well. Yeah, I think. Let's see, let's use these guys. How many guys are in there? Nine and seven. Both of them are pinned. And their morale has dropped to F because of how many attacks they've taken. Oh, there's another guy. Ooh, two more guys. Nice. Oh, another guy. Let's see how we're doing going in the last turn here. Um, 30 men losses for them, 5 tanks, and for us it's 10 and 5. So, they got 18 points. Unless they make a big push this turn. I think this is the last one. This is 1540, the 24th of June, 1941. Looks like we're going to have one tank that might live through this encounter. Maybe. Uh oh, lost a guy. Don't pin our guys because we need them. Oh, two guys. All right. So we're going to, uh, yeah, we're going to take the just. Just these nine guys. Go. Ha ha ha. We got that point back. <laughs> and. Throw that satchel charge on his head. Throw that one on his head too. Throw one more. Oh, well, our squad of nine or no, a squad of eight. <laughs> but they were heroic for the motherland. Just a couple of pot shots here. Oh, we did something this vehicle. It is immobilized. We immobilized it at least. Uh, we'll take a couple more pot shots. I think the Axis forces are going to win this. Oh, there's one. Nice. All right, heroic tank. 
Is he gonna make it? He is gonna make it through this scenario. Look at him go. He shot at that guy. Damn. Alright, well, that'll be it. And let's count it up. Russians, objective points zero, zero, zero. Total points is minus 12. A Russian major defeat. Dun, 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 dun. There you go, look at that, 14 men, they lost 34. It was five vehicles, we lost five, but they lost better vehicles than we lost. It was a total major defeat. Alright, so there you go guys, hopefully you enjoyed that. That is John Tiller's squad battles, or infantry battles, or whatever it's called. Uh, and uh, that was the battle of... Uh, well, I can't even remember what the heck it's called. Uh, Rotisserini. Rissarani. Rissaroni. <laughs> there you go. Alrighty, Philip and Steeler fan and Gray Mauser. Hope you all have a good night. We'll see you next time. Thanks for coming out and watching. Everyone have a good night and we'll see you guys next time.